week of Sex in the City, I'm sorry to say this is also the season of the swimsuit. Bane of, I think, all of our existences, isn't it? Dee, what's your... The hour of my discontent is to try on a new bathing suit. I'm a one-piece person, um, always have been. Can't do the tank bikini, bikini, and between bikini. Um, I, and I don't swim, so I am a one-piece bathing suit that kind of lounges by the pool, you know. It's a little, nice little sheer cover-up until my husband forces me in the water and I kind of slide over to the pool and pull the cover up as I'm getting into it and get into the water. So very conscious of my body, but want to show it to some degree, so the one piece is enough for me, so I'm a one piece girl. And I bet you accessorize on the beach. To the hilt. As far, everyone says, are you actually going in the water again? Why did the sunglasses, headband, earring, necklace, bangle, ankle bracelet throw you? I mean, did you not think? I know. For me, my stomach has never seen the light of day. I've been wearing a one-piece ever since I was a little girl. I, I don't even know mm -hmm. what it's like to wear a two-piece. I have to tell you, though, I don't even try them on anymore. Oh, you don't? I just look at them and I'm like, yeah, sure, that'll fit. <laughs> and then I, I half the time, I'm, you know, I never even think to go to the beach with just my bathing suit. I am always like, okay, do I have shorts or a skirt yeah. or a dress that I could throw over the bathing suit? Then I'm lying on the beach and I'm rolling this up and yes. pushing this down and is this sucking in and is the roll over here? So basically half the time I just go swimming in my bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> I love the beach. Actually, this is the first year I've, or well, last year was the first summer that I got a real beach because in Wisconsin, it's there's you know lakes, but it's mostly boating or on pontoons or whatever. I've always been a water baby. I love it, and I've always been a bikini baby because I just the one piece just does not work for me. I think they look horrendous on me. Um, actually, this weekend I went to the beach in my bikini and I got this really bizarre cow spotted uh, sunburn all over my legs. It was the most bizarre thing. Um, but I'm the type of person who's playing volleyball and is running around, you know, playing catch or in the water and very much so. And so I tried on a bandeau top. Oh boy, that didn't work at all. Like, <laughs> I was like, I don't think they're supposed to be down there. <laughs> no, it's funny because I'm a little bit big, but my breasts never fill out the top. Really? Um, everything else fits and I'm always like, I'm pushing and pulling and pushing and pulling and total polar opposite of you. I have the chair with the umbrella, the hat, sunglasses, and the book. <laughs> and a cocktail usually. Yeah, I'm with you. And that's it. Don't touch me, let me finish my chapter. Maybe I'll go dip my feet in the water. I don't want to move, don't talk to me. Well, I'm that's a time. tankini. I'm, I'm definitely tankini all the way. I am short-waisted. And I need two sizes, and if I try a one piece to fit me, it gathers somewhere in the middle in this very odd way that sort of is supposed to be ruching, but on me just looks like major folds. It's, it's <laughs> sort of let the good times roll, and it just keeps rolling. So it's, it's not the best. It's really funny because I see a lot of plus-size women on the beach who are in like teeny, teeny, tiny bikinis, and I'm like, you know, in a way, and I'm like, I just applaud them. Like that's so wonderful and courageous and they're so like proud of themselves and their bodies, but for some reason I haven't gotten over that hump yet. Actually, you know what's funny is this last summer was the first summer I didn't wear shorts or a cover up. I think it was the most yeah. invigorating experience. I was like, let's go. Let yeah. me show off my body, you know, and you can see my jellies. I don't care. <laughs> but isn't it when you're going to see people you know? No, I was trained not to show up from birth. So to me, <laughs> whether there's someone there that I know or not, I'm just so used to kind of being covered up that for me to let go on the beach and in other aspects, it was just not the easiest thing. Really. Now, were you a full figured little kid? I've always been. I've always been fluctuating. Even as a little kid, I was always fluctuating between full-figured and regular. I've always been that kind of pleasantly plump girl. But or, oh, you have such a pretty face. Oh, I love that <laughs> one. And your personality, oh my god. <laughs>